So this video is going to be about uh, Van der Waals forces. So what Van der Waals forces are is a type of weak molecular interaction that is responsible for allowing two nonpolar molecules to interact with one another. So and we remember from the video on covalent bonds that the bond between a carbon atom and a hydrogen atom is a nonpolar covalent bond, which means the electrons are shared equally between them, and so that you don't have any regions of partial negative or partial positive charge. But at the same time, these two molecules have their electrons moving randomly around each atom. So at any given time, we could have the electrons get randomly accumulated on one side of the molecule. So when this happens, we have many more negative charges on this side than we have on this side. So that gives this a partial negative charge and this other half of the molecule partial positive charge. So now, in a neighboring molecule, we can have the same sort of thing happening. So by random chance, we might have all of our electrons end up on this side to give this a partial negative charge and this side a partial positive charge. Now when that happens, we know that partial uh, positive charges and partial negative charges are going to be attracted to one another. So now the two sides of these molecules have a way that they can interact with each other because they have a different charge. So this is going to be really important in um, forming biological membranes like our cell membranes um, or our mitochondrial membranes. And it's also going to be very important in holding some larger uh, biomacromolecules together. I hope you found this video really helpful. The concepts and information presented in these videos will be true regardless of what biology course you're taking. However, the material we covered in this video is specifically referencing material covered in Campbell Biology's 11th edition. Remember that if you are an enrolled Baylor student, we do offer free tutoring on the first floor of the Sid Richardson building, and you can schedule a free 30-minute appointment to have one-on-one -on -one tutoring online, or you can stop by during any of our business hours. For more information about the services we provide, you can go to our website at www.baylor.edu tutoring. Thank you.